first time into the East Coast of Canada. I've been to Vancouver before, but I have to say this is really different. This kind of reminds me of France, a little twist of Central Europe, mixed with the best parts of the US. I absolutely love it. The crowd here is amazing. The track is really cool, and everybody is situated right outside that stadium. It has all the makings of a fantastic group show. Place, nice grass, uh, the fans are really into it. You know, some of them are camping out here over the weekend. Uh, the competitors are actually quite good, and uh, there's some good competition. It's definitely a, an experience. I, I like it up here, and it's not like back home. People are a lot nicer. I'm used to people being assholes, and that's just kind of the way it is in California. It's a, it's a lot more laid back. The drivers are really friendly, and the track's awesome. The women are awesome. It's an experience for sure. Fans seem to love drifting out here, so it's always a blast coming out to a place where the fans are loving what you know we do. Honestly, a strong local drift scene as well. Lots of local drivers killing it and uh, qualifying super well. So, enjoy my time out here. Honestly, Canada to me has a little like influence of Europe. That's where I'm from, so I actually really enjoy it. You know, uh, it's really green and pretty. So, uh, yeah, kind of reminds me of Europe back home. The locals here are basically badass, so we're gonna really have to charge hard to get away with you going back there? finishing. track really fun and the crowd's amazing the crowd's yeah. really uh, into it uh, we love the fans here everybody gives us a really warm reception they love getting us they love the, the cars and and uh, drifting here has a really good reception you know I, I can hear all the way from back in the pit when we're running I can hear the, the crowd you know roaring over you know everything going on back there and, and it's really impressive because there's not many if any FD events where that I ever witnessed something like that I would really like to do a whole Formula D Canada season, for sure. I would really like to do that. I want to do Formula D Canada, the US series, and Japan as well. So I'm really trying to expand and be as international as possible, and it's, it's awesome up here. I wouldn't mind being up here more than once, that's for sure. Not like we're used to back home. Back home, we can lay our bumper on the wall, ride it the whole way. It doesn't suck you in, it doesn't tear your car up, but out here, it doesn't take much to step over the line. The, the first turn. 
turn is a bit bumpy, but I mean it's sort of a challenge. You know, you're riding a wall and there's a few like dips in the pavement, so you kind of like bouncing around in there. But coming out of the first turn through the the drag strip and then that left into the second outer zone, that's definitely one of my favorite parts of the track. I mean, it's full throttle, drop the hammer. It's pretty treacherous, honestly. There's so much K rail there. And I've been grazing those walls, you know, trying to go deep and, and get like a good solid run in and, you know, make it fun for the crowd and just a gnarly track. <laughs> even rowdier than the government people. So hats off to you guys. And that's the trick. That's it.